this video, we're going to go over some of the steps required to set up an autopilot. I assume you have already connected and synced up your Amazon advertising account. If you have not, check the description box down below for the links on how to connect your Amazon advertising account to AI Hello. I also assume you already know what an autopilot is, how it works, and how it would help you grow your revenues and decrease your ad cost. While you don't necessarily need to know about all of this before setting up an autopilot, it's a good idea to have some kind of cursory knowledge about autopilot before you switch it on. With that said, let's get started and jump right into it. If you have followed the previous videos, your Amazon account should already be connected and synced up by now. If you have not, feel free to stop this video and watch the other video on how to connect and sync your Amazon account to AI Hello. Head over to the Amazon Ads menu and then click on the Campaigns menu. By the way, if you have just logged into AI Hello and Amazon Advertising is already connected, then you should, by default, land on this page. Nevertheless, you can always click on the menu and navigate to this page. On this page are a series of tabs that shows your profiles, your campaigns, your ad groups, your keywords, and your targets. The initial view is the list of Amazon profiles. These are usually the different marketplaces for the Amazon ads region. If you have multiple regions connected, you can switch between them in the region switcher on the top left. In the list of profiles, select the profile by clicking on the marketplace name. The checkbox also allows you to select multiple profiles. For this demonstration, I'm just going to click on the marketplace, which will automatically select a marketplace and open up the campaigns tab. The campaigns tab displays all your active and paused campaigns for the particular Amazon profile that you just selected. There are many filters and advanced reporting features on this tab but we won't talk about it right now in this walkthrough. What we are going to do right now is just set up an autopilot for some of the campaigns. And this, in this list of campaigns, the quickest way to set up an autopilot is by clicking on the autopilot campaign button. This is the blue shield button just before the campaign name in the list of campaigns. Click on the autopilot button and it brings up the autopilot settings box. All you need to do is just to switch it on and hit the Save button. Of course, you can also change the target ACoS, which by default is set to 30%. There are also advanced options that you can view by clicking on the Advanced Options button, and we will be going over that in detail in our subsequent videos, so stay tuned. For most of the sellers, the default setting of Autopilot suffices. Also, there are a couple of other ways you can set up Autopilot. Let's go over them quickly. You can select one single campaign and click on the Autopilot button on the top left. If you want to enable Autopilot for multiple campaigns, you can select multiple campaigns and click on the Bulk Edit. We have a separate video explaining in detail about Bulk Edit. You can also enable Autopilot and adjust it directly from the logs. When you select a campaign to view the logs, you can click on the Autopilot button in the Campaigns Details section and enable or adjust your Autopilot. And that is all there is to know about setting up an Autopilot. We will be posting more videos about advanced techniques on Autopilot, as well as some ways that some of our most successful sellers use Autopilot. Hit the subscribe button down below if you would like to be notified as soon as we post a video. Till then, bye bye!